So have you guys heard about this new super intelligence team that Mark Zuckerberg is personally putting together? It's basically like the, the Avengers of AI, if you will. Long story short, Zuckerberg wants to develop artificial super intelligence or AI that is smarter than every single person on every single topic. AI that truly changes the world. He wants to create that. So what he's doing is he's putting together a team of 50 engineers, hand-selected 50 engineers to solely build that. That's their entire purpose, their entire goal, build artificial super intelligence. And guess what? Rumors are that he's paying $10 million per year in cold, hard cash to people that are part of that team. $10 million a year and eight figure annual salary. That's that's unprecedented. Yes, people have made a lot more in Silicon Valley, in AI, in tech, but through the stock, through stock options, through RSUs, as the stock price goes up a thousand percent, ten thousand percent, then they make a lot of money through that. People don't get paid ten million dollars per year in salary, in cold hard cash in Silicon Valley until now until Zuckerberg decided he wants to create artificial super intelligence. And guess what? This is, this is a businessman, folks. Zuckerberg is a businessman, a really savvy one at that, CEO of a trillion dollar company. You really think he's pouring $500 million. So there's really 50 engineers and they're getting 10 million a year in cold hard cash. That's 500 million a year. Do you really think he's pouring $500 million per year into an effort that he doesn't think is gonna get any ROI for the next 10, 15, 20, 25 years? No. He's doing it now because he thinks ROI is just around the corner, which means he thinks artificial super intelligence is just around the corner. And that should scare the living daylights out of you. Because if you think AI has changed the world a lot in the past three years, wait until you get artificial super intelligence. That's gonna change everything about everything and it's going to profoundly divide the world between those who know how to harness AI, between those who invested in AI and those who did not, those who got left on the sidelines. Which one are you gonna be? You can be one of these people that's gonna be a king of the new technology AI world or somebody that's really a serf and a worker for the kings. I said be a king. I say invest in AI. I say go all in with AI. AI with AI, I think that's the way ahead.